Hi everyone! As you may already know, USB mice can be connected to the Switch for use in Game Builder Garage. Today I'll show you exactly how that works, test a few different USB mice, and show off some useful tips for getting the most out of your mouse while in the programming screen. Let's begin! Connecting up a wired mouse is as simple as inserting the USB into either one of the front USB ports on the Nintendo Switch dock. It's important to know that the mouse won't be usable on the system home screen, so you'll have to launch Game Builder Garage to test whether it's working. Once you're on the title screen, and if your mouse is compatible, you should see the mouse cursor. From there, you're good to go. Wireless mice that include a USB Bluetooth dongle can also be connected in the same way. Just insert the Bluetooth receiver into either one of the USB ports on the front of the dock and then check to make sure your mouse is switched on. USB mice don't only work in docked mode though. If you're playing in portable mode or you have a switch light, you can connect up your USB mouse to the USB Type-C port located on the bottom of the switch. Although you'll need a USB-C to USB-A adapter, sometimes called a USB OTG adapter. As of recording, the only place Nintendo has officially stated that GBG works with USB mice is on on the Japanese FAQ for Game Builder Garage. There's no guarantee that every USB mouse will work, although of the three mice I tried, all three worked without issue. Now let's go through some of the features, including some of the more obscure ones available while using the mouse in programming mode. As you'd expect, left clicking allows you to select and interact with Node on. The scroll wheel lets you zoom in and out of the programming screen, and clicking the middle mouse button in allows you to drag the viewport, or in other words, reposition the camera on the programming screen. Additionally, if your mouse has side buttons, these can actually be used as shortcuts for undo and redo. Nice! One super useful feature that the mouse allows is for copying and pasting. To do this, double click, hold and drag over your selection of node on to copy and paste. And to wrap up, Nintendo even included a cute little easter egg on the title screen. If you left click and hold, the little G from the logo will follow your cursor wherever it goes. That's it for today. If you have any additional tips for using the mouse in GBG, share them in the comments. We have a Discord where you can share your creations and chat to other builders, and the link for that is in the description. I also regularly stream GBG, so why not subscribe so you'll be the first to know when I go live. Bye bye